Well, all right, this is what it looks like today if you're heading out the door. We're going to see our temperatures make it up to about 71 to 73 degrees later on today. For Los Angeles, it'll be about 75 degrees, but time we're heading into your lunch hour. So again, it is going to be another warm day. Excessive heat warnings, advisories all across Southern California today. We're back to about 93 degrees in a downtown Los Angeles degrees if you are making your way out towards our low desert areas. All right, we'll have more coming up in a little bit, and we'll talk about our changes here in Southern California because we are talking about a heat wave that's going to continue for a few more days. So, I mean, this is summer. We knew it was getting out the door. Uh, we're going to see our temperatures make it up to, it looks like, those 70s. 70, 77 degrees over into areas of Los Angeles today. So, it is going to be another nice one. But, yeah, we are talking about some changes here in Southern California. There is some fog out there, too. I just want to make mention of it. If you are going to be heading out the door, some of the fog that we're dealing with this morning is really right along the South Bay and then hooking around Long Beach. So, we do have a dense fog advisory in these areas. It should part and we should get back to sunshine this afternoon. But more clouds do develop overnight and then into tomorrow morning. So, we will be dealing with some more cloud coverage. So, that marine layer is coming in and out for the evenings and the mornings. But uh, as we make your way out towards your Belinda, we have a heat advisory. We have excessive heat watches in this red color here, excessive heat warnings in that magenta. And this is that dense fog advisory stretching from Beverly Hills down to Rancho Pels, Verdes, Long Beach, Lakewood. You are looking at about a quarter of a mile of visibility. We have heat advisories in this orange color stretching from areas of Orange County all the way down into South Orange County and then inland into Riverside County communities. And then some more of those heat advisories up towards our mountain communities of the San Bernardino even right wood, you're dealing with that too. And then here's that excessive heat watch in that darker red color. So really just getting ready to turn it. Live in Los Angeles, temperatures into Long Beach are going to make it up to about 66 degrees. It's back to 73 if you're making your way out towards Wrightwood. Temperatures in a Riverside, 66 and 83 degrees over in Apple Valley. Uh, we're back to about 68 degrees. Being moving right over California. Whenever a dome of high pressure develops, we really have a hard time moving this mechanism out of the way. It really takes a larger system to come in and push a big dome out to the east. And unfortunately, we just don't have a big area of low pressure. And usually we get those really nice looking big cyclonic movements in the winter time. Those are our big areas of low pressure. And we just don't really have very many of those coming on in during the summer months. So the dome remains and it looks like that dome is going to continue to heat us up for the next several days. It's 89 degrees for Los Angeles as we get into your Tuesday. Your Wednesday, it's back to about 91 degrees. And then you head out to your Thursday, it's back to 91 as well. And then 118 degrees out towards Las Vegas. So it is going to be heating up even into our desert areas as we get into the next few days. Today, temperatures, we have triple digits across the board, 24 degrees. So now we have a new all-time record for Palm Springs area, and we're not too far away from today. Wednesday, 104. It's 102 on your Thursday. We keep those 90s moving around Friday, Saturday, and into your Sunday. And if you are